Hey everyone, Louis Online here. Thanks for checking out this podcast with West Coast hip hop legend DJ Quick. Quick is an artist, a producer, and a beat maker who is currently working on the much anticipated, much delayed album Detox by Dr. Dre. So, first off, I asked Quick, does he think Detox will ever be released? I don't really believe that Dr. Dre is going to release that album. I think he's kind of over it, and and rightfully so. I mean, if he does put it out, then it's gonna be it's gonna come out without you know without the fanfare. It's probably he's probably gonna just sneak it out and watch what it does. You know what I mean? But to me, it's like he's done it. You know, he's he's already succeeded. He's he's over 150 million records sold. Like he doesn't have to prove to anybody that he can still make a hot record. And I've been siding with him on that because. He, you know, it, what, what else? What else can he do? He, you can't reinvent the wheel. He's already made all the wheels in, in hip hop. You know what I mean? So it's kind of hard. I, I think it's, it's it's hard for him to to let go of another brainchild that he might even deem that people won't even really appreciate because some of it is advanced. I've listened to it, and it's a it's a pretty smart record. Like it's it's advanced. It's up there. So you know, maybe he. You know, I don't know, man. I, I, I'm out with him 100 percent if he doesn't want to release Detox because in the in his in his world, it's just another plaque, if you understand. Yeah. But it, you know, because of how finicky hip hop fans are now, and how you know how here today, gone tomorrow, things could be, I wouldn't want to take that chance with my career either. Especially if this record would be my capstone. Why would I want to take a chance with somebody ridiculing it and talking about how whack it is or gated? Like you don't even want to give anybody any room for that kind of stuff when you have such a stellar record of you know of success. Next off, Quick revealed what some of the tracks on Detox will sound like and the ideas that Dr. Dre is working with. You know, he's studying, like, like real heavy composers, you know, and he was adding some of that, that, that feeling to the music, like, you know, from, you know, Tchaikovsky and, 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 and Chopin and, you know, and Beethoven. Like, he, he was really going deep with it. It's really advanced. Like, it's, it's actually, to me, it's kind of avant-garde. Lastly, Quick spoke about the pressure of working with a genius like Dr. Dre. Dr. Dre is, he's open to ideas, but he's got a different way of processing his, his thoughts. Like, he doesn't, he's not conventional as a producer, like the Quincy Jones would be. Dr. Dre is, he's a little more, he's, 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 he's very stern in the studio, and almost to a fault. Like, he'll work, you know, he'll work diligently on one part of a record for hours upon hours upon hours, and then only to scrap it if he doesn't, if he doesn't feel that it's addictive enough. If, if it doesn't have that, that comeback feeling to it, like if it's, not, if it's not something you can hear forever, then he, he doesn't want any part of it. But he's a slave driver in the studio. Like, he, you know, he'll, he'll make you cry. Like, you can't believe that, that you actually have to be perfect in the studio to work with him. And if you're not, you know, you, you won't be in the studio with him, period. He's, he's, he's very professional, but at the same time, he's totally 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 mean when it comes to production like he he'll tell you exactly how he feels about something if you don't like it he's a perfectionist and it's just, like again is he's almost a perfectionist to a fault you know he but but that's what defines him that's what made him who he is you know he's iconic in that way is that he don't just let things fly because you know again his his pride and his you know his his career is riding on it